guest tonight was a cast member on Saturday Night Live and the Larry Sanders Show. She's also appeared in There's Something About Mary. Please welcome the very funny Sarah Silverman. Uh, how are you? Nice to have you here. It's nice to be here. Yeah, thank you. Really Thanks for good. coming. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Life's okay? It's going all right? It's fantastic. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you don't lie to me. I don't know. I went, I went to the bathroom, mm -hmm. you know, backstage, and the ladies' room is out of order. I had to use the men's room, which is so humiliating, you know, sitting in that urinal. <laughs> <laughs> dirty. Dirty, dirty. It's not good, huh? Yeah. All right. And then I flush and my back is all wet. <laughs> Work that. Yeah, that sounds fun. Uh, you know, last time you were on the show, we were talking about strippers. I don't know how we got on that subject. We were talking about strippers. You, you have a fascination with them, clearly, because you like to talk about them. I do. No, I do. I, I think strippers should be mentors for women, you know? I mean, <laughs> if only for the reason that they wax their asses, you know? Seriously. What? Because they, they deserve the Purple Heart for that. Uh -huh. You know, it's clean. You know what I'm saying? No, I, I would don't. never. I'm scared. You're scared. You know the. Clo I mean, I, I. I'm scared to do it. I mean, I. The closest I've ever come to waxing my ass is once, uh, I got it washed and styled. <laughs> that doesn't hurt, you know, minus the curlers. Yeah. Well, you know, some people say that it's that the strippers. A lot of them would, you know, not so. Cause a lot of them end up in pornography. Yeah. How do you feel about that? Yeah. What are you gonna do? <laughs> so, you know, okay. I mean, I would never do porn. I mean, actually, the only if I ever did porn, the only reason would, would be because I don't think that there are enough, you know, uh, there's enough like Jewish representation in porn. <laughs> really? Thank you. Wow, you. I would do that. You've really hit a nerve here. That would be my. I'd go. You no, know my slogan would be. What? Slap my tukas. <laughs> Slap my tukas. <laughs> That's, that's yeah. pretty sexy, yeah. But, uh, uh, midgets. What? Um, midgets, uh, <laughs> What the hell was that? The politically correct word for midget... Yeah, is not midget, it's... It's little person. Little person. And I just think that's funny because it's, like, the only politically correct word that is actually more offensive. <laughs> than the real word. term. Yeah, midgets don't like... They don't even like that. I've got the inside track, actually, on it, and they don't even like to be called... Little people. They yeah. don't like that? No, they much prefer a, uh, yes, you are. They like that. <laughs> 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 what wait, wait. So what, what, what's wrong? You got all sad. <sighs> Nothing. I don't know. I just feel... I, you know, I said that midget thing, and I wanted you to laugh, and mm -hmm. you did, and I'm, I'm grateful. I'm, I'm grateful, you know, that you did, but I just... You know, it's not right to make fun of midgets, and it's, you know, they're just people who are born, like, extra super small, and, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah. Why do we do it? You know, everyone knows, you, I don't think there's anyone here that thinks it's right to make fun of midgets, but we do, because we don't fear them. You know? <laughs> really. That's a good point. It's sad. You're, you're, I, I, you've been on the show many times. I, you're never afraid to offend anyone, are you? You no, don't, it's not, it's not something you worry about. Well, you know, thank you, or if that's a compliment, or, no, you know. it's not. No, I was kidding. <laughs> but, uh, I mean, that's not really true because, well, I mean, like that whole midget thing. Right. I just was touched by that. You were and, touched, like, that's true. A while ago, I had a joke that had the N word in it. Ooh, you know what I'm talking that word, about. Right? Yeah. It had the N-word in it, and I thought it was so cool and so hip and um, edgy, you know? Right. And I was doing it all around, and then I was at Caroline's, and I was um, doing my set, mm -hmm. and there was a table of black people sitting in the front row. Actually, I think they were African-American. Mm -hmm. And, uh, <laughs> I, I, and I, didn't, I didn't do the joke. Right. I couldn't uh, bring myself to do the joke. And then you have to ask yourself, well, is that a really an edgy joke or is that, you know, a racist joke? Right. And, I, and I didn't do the joke because I feared them, mm -hmm. you know? Right. And I... Right. All right, no, right. I mean, but I... I ended up changing the joke because of that to chinks. <laughs> Now, 
Now, people might think we live in a sensitive culture. People might think, Sarah, that you're a racist. They might. They might actually oh believe that. Oh, my God. No, yeah. Conan. I, I'm going out with a guy who's half black who is totally going to break my heart. That's a... Oh, my God. I just heard myself. That is so pessimistic. I'm such a pessimist. That's mm -hmm. such a bad attitude. He's half white. Okay. <laughs> but, um... Oh I go God. out with all... I go out with all kinds. I'm not here anymore. Oh. Seriously. <laughs> so, okay. I, go out, I went out with a, uh, I went out with a, a Mexican guy for a while. Uh-huh. If you're out there, hey, Paco, whatever. Yeah. You went out with a Mexican, then? Uh-huh. Yeah, but, I mean, I had to end it, because every time we had sex, I had diarrhea for, like, a week. <laughs> okay. That's only fun for only so long, you know? Uh, Sarah, thank you very much for coming by. Thank you. Thank I'm you for coming so by. Fun. Sarah Silverman, everybody. We'll take a break. We'll be right back.